night I'm at the Doncaster Brewery and Tap to see Aubrey Brakeledge supported by Pete Drake. This should be such a fun night. Let's go in and see what, what it's all about. The venue is in Doncaster on the edge of the city centre. It's only a few minutes walk from the centre and if you want something to eat there are plenty of pubs and restaurants within the centre. There is some on-street parking which is available after 6pm, up to 6pm it's loading only. And uh, nearby there is a multi-storey car park as well as a surface car park. The multi-storey has an evening rate of £1.10p if you park after 6pm. If you are travelling by train, the venue is a 7 minute walk from the train station. The first artist on was Pete Drake, followed by the headline act Aubrey Drake Lidge. It was a night of musical comedy and here are some videos. <laughs> Shop with dirty, always use self service. <laughs> we don't like them, check out girls, they always make you nervous. You like this one? A duet with Nick Parker, that would be a starter. <laughs> Guess I will never know. <laughs> I wasn't asked. I wasn't asked. I won't throw in the towel, I'm not scared of Simon Cowell Bruno, Holden or Louis Walsh I think I'm rather pleased I'm not their cup of tea They've probably tried to teach me how to dance She doesn't leave the house She likes to work from home She sells them on the internet And takes orders down the phone Cause she sells, she smells to men Who don't feel well It's money for hot hair Trapped in a jam jar Better chat, right? In the same way, you either you undermine their attempt at taking our flag, our culture, our history, and you fuck with it, or you melt their brains in another way. For example, Bella Chow. We all know the song Bella Chow. Bella Chow, Bella Chow, Bella Chow, Chow, Chow. That's what they're expecting. They're prepared for that. So this is how we do it differently. Now I'm going to ask you guys to say Bella Chow. And I will show, I will tell you <coughs> my idea. Okay, so I want to say three, two, one, I want you guys to yell, Bella Chow. Okay, three, two, one. Bella Chow! Chow. Perfect, we'll do it again. <coughs> this is how we destroy fascism, ladies and gentlemen. Both of them. One, two, three. Bella, Bella Chow! Da, 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 da. <laughs> One, two, three. Bella You yell when they know what's fucking hitting. Especially if you get a horde of 40 hippies to do it with an intense step. Once was a man. That man had a beard. He shaved off his beard and now he's dead. <laughs> Once was a woman, her husband had a beard. She asked him to shave it off, and now she's dead. Now they're dead, now they're dead. Shave their beards, and now they're dead. Shave your beard. You'll be and you'll be dead. You'll be dead. <laughs> I would punch you. <laughs> but then we'd have to run. Cause bears 
guys are fucking huge. I don't have a gun if you get your last mistrue. I will punch a small bear for you. <laughs> and here's some photos of the night. I've got to say, this was a very enjoyable night. A lot of comedy, a lot of music, a lot of laughter. And what a great venue. Really good selection of beers. And I really enjoyed it. Well worth going. So it's a typical Root Rocks promoted event. In that you always get quality. It's very intimate. And I will definitely be revisiting this venue in the future. There's only one more thing to say, and that is go out and support live music. This is Roger from I Can See The Stage From Here saying goodbye. (laughs) 